हेलो वॉचर एंड सब्सक्राइबर्स दिस ट्यूटोरियल इज पर्टिकुलरली फॉर द बिगिनर्स ऑफ द लर्नर ऑफ एक्सेल ओके सो इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल सी हाउ यू कैन जनरेट द फॉर्मूलाज इन एक्सेल बिकॉज मेनी स्टूडेंट दे फाइंड डिफिकल्टी ऑफ जनरेटिंग और क्रिएटिंग फॉर्मूला बाय देयर ओन सो दैट द रीजन इन दिस एक्सेल शीट आई ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड टेबल विद द बेसिक ऑपरेशन एडिशन सब्ट्रैक्शन मल्टीप्लीकेशन एंड डिविजन ओके सो वी विल सी हियर हाउ यू कैन जनरेट दिस टास्क बाय यूजिंग यूर ओन फॉर्मूला ओके इन एक्सेल प्रीडिफाइंड functions are already there but as a learner as a student you must create formula by your own because uh, in future you may getting any task suppose you were build teacher or you will work in company then you will be getting some tasks so if you use the excel your lot of time will save for example uh, uh, creating mark sheet or uh, to feed the student information then there is a role of create the formula so as a student you must know how to generate a formula by your own so whenever you create a formula they, there are two thing first thing is that suppose i am clicking here then once i click it any cell this is what individual cell so suppose if i click on this a then what happen this upside it indicate the address okay suppose if i click here this is what the address of that cell and what is the address a3 why it is a3 because if you observe this value it represent the column a and row t so these are nothing but the column numbers as you learn in the uh beginning of this tutorial series a b c d these are the column and 1 2 3 these are the row so if i click on this you see the address highlighted c3 because what we are in the this cell is present in the c row and third column so its address is c3 so when you learn from creating formula you must understand the strategy of identifying cell address so if i click here it is present in column c and the row 6 so first here you have to think about its address and its address is c6 okay so the address means it consists of or it start with the column name and it is followed by the row number okay got it now after that you have to understand operator so for performing operation you have the operator basically we use addition subtraction multiplication division we have other operator also but these are the basics so we will see how we can use it so now here i want to do addition of these two number okay so how you will do first it start with equal very simple then after that you have to write you have to write their address suppose this 6 is present this 6 is present in which address a3 2 is present in which address that is b3 so you can manually write here a3 plus b3 got it once i press enter my answer is getting correct 6 plus 2 8 there is one more way suppose if you write equal and even if you click here it will automatically take it address so your time will save and there is no chance of doing mistake now next value is 5 so i will click there press enter now i already got the result here now whatever the formula is there i want to apply here so you can just drag it down so every time you don't need to create a formula so you see here also addition is coming even though i didn't write formula here same for the subtraction but for the subtraction case you know now there will be need of different operator so again you use equal you just click here and then you write minus then i want the subtraction between this a and b so you click here and then you press enter the result will be 4 then what happen you want we want this result in the uh, downside row so you just drag down 
then next is multiplication so as usual again we will do so I want this value and then for multiplication you keep in mind there will be the use of star okay not multiple symbol then next value is 2 so I just click there then you see now 6 into 2 is 12 so then uh, once I drag it down then the result will come in the rest of the row easily then next for the division again you use equal sign as usual then this is the value a 6 divisible by 2 so for divisible you use this sign okay it will perform the division operation and next value is 2 so I just click there so a3 b3 the values are respectively 6 and 2 so its answer is what 3 so then I drag it downside so you see rest of the result is also coming and it is correct I am taking a simple number so that you can verify your result also so here we have done simple operation addition subtraction multiplication and division so once you understood this basic operation then you can go for learning any formula okay so these are the basic thing as a beginner you must know how to perform addition subtraction multiplication and division so this tutorial is particularly for the beginner of the learner of excel so when you are learning creating formula of the excel you must know the two things about the address of cell and the basic operator so you can combine them you can bunch them and create the formula and each and every formula start with the equal so don't forget to give the equal sign in the formula okay so thanks for watching this tutorial thank you